piece of jewellery is the ultimate intimate object. It's the closest thing a woman ever wears to their skin. Absolutely. Isn't it? You know. And for a lot of people, jewellery becomes that. It becomes a sort of second skin. I think this book, what we really want to do is just to do exactly what the title says, to celebrate jewellery in all its forms, wasn't it? Absolutely. It's just there to, to show how beautiful jewels can be at all sort of uh, price level. Well, I'm very partial to the, the Windsor Panther. I found it so feminine, so sensual. Do you remember we were showing it in Moscow, I think it was? This lady said, oh, what's so special about that? I took it out of the case and put it on her wrist. And she said, oh my God, oh, I yes. see what's special about <laughs> that. And that's what jewellery is all about, isn't it? Then what's my favourite piece? I absolutely adore the Napoleon cameo. It is an extraordinary piece of jewellery. It's yeah. fantastic quality of carving oh, in the cameo. Amazing. It's so imperial, you know, it's absolutely this sort of the folie de grandeur of Napoleon. If I had to give any suggestion to a young collector or a new collector, is first of all go with your instinct mm. and go where your taste takes you. And, and choose what you will be always happy to wear and will become part of your life. I think that the message we wanted to give to our potential reader with this book was to show that uh, jewels are true miniature works of art, uh, how behind each jewel there is a human story. You know, it's like lifting the corner of a curtain, isn't it, on the past. It's fascinating.